Hi. Hi. How are you feeling? Are you hungry? Do you want to make those Thai noodles for dinner? You love making those. I'm not hungry right now, but thank you. Is it Riley? What does she want? She probably just wants to hang out, but every time we're together, she just wants to talk about how I am or why I don't call as much. I just don't want to pity. Is there anything I can do? Pity. I wish she would let me in. When I'm ready to talk, you'll be the first one to know. Why don't you go take a long shower and I'll go make us some dinner, okay? Okay. Can I say something? Okay. I think you should go visit Brooke. What? You haven't been, and I think it'd be really good for you to go visit her grave. I don't want to talk about this. I've tried to be there for you, but you just stay in your bedroom all day. It's been three months since the accident. You can't keep living like this. I can't keep living like this. I don't want to. Please, Charlie, you ran out before the funeral even started. You have to move on. I don't want to. Charlie, please, just think about this. We're done talking about this. Charlie. Enough! God! I'm going to bed. Hey. Ellie, I just wanted to apologize for the way that I spoke to you last night. I know you're just trying to help. What is Riley doing here? We need to talk to you. About what? You need to go to her grave. Unbelievable. Charlie, you haven't been eating. You quit your job. You just stay in the bedroom all day and you barely even talk to me. You've stopped returning phone calls. You never leave the house. Stop. She's gone. She isn't coming back. You have to try to accept this to move on. Move on. Move on? How, how do I move on from my baby sister dying in a car accident? What would you have me do? Hmm? What, I'm just supposed to move on from the most horrific day of my life? Just keep going like nothing happened? That's not what we're saying. Then what are you saying? Please, I know you feel guilty about all this, but you have to try. What did you say? I've never told you about any guilt. You read my journal? Both of you, didn't you? Yes, but it's only because we are worried about you. I can't believe this. He's just trying to understand. I can't be here. Wait, Charlie. Don't leave. I'm finished. You can go out in the car and I will meet you out there. Hey, Mom. Yeah, we're on our way. Yeah, I, I picked Brooke up.
Okay. Okay, well, I gotta go, so I'll see you soon. Bye. I know that face. What's... What'd you break? I didn't break anything. Oh, you didn't? Okay, well, I got my eye on you. Your gift, milady. Thank you, madame. Very kind. Brooke. <laughs> Thank you. It's very pretty. It's nothing crazy. I had to borrow money from mom. Oh, really? And does, uh, does mom know about that arrangement? What she doesn't know won't hurt her. I'm so gonna tell her? In your dreams, or is telling her about your prom night free game. You wouldn't. <laughs> uh, okay, thank you, bye. We messed up. What are we gonna do, where is she? I don't know, she's not answering her phone. She isn't at her mom's or any of her friends. She's never gonna forgive me. I'm gonna go find her. What are you gonna do? Drive around all night? She could be anywhere. Yeah, if that's what it takes. I'm so sorry. I'm so, so sorry. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm so proud of you. I know it's hard, but she's always gonna be here for you. Yeah. I just miss her so much. Do you want a minute alone? Yeah, I'll meet you back at the car. Hi, Brooke. Sorry I'm late. I've missed you. Things are just not the same without you. The world doesn't look the same. It doesn't feel the same. I knew that going out with your friends that late was a bad idea. I should have asked you, should have told you to stay home, to stay with me. I tried to be normal, smile the way I did, hang out with friends, pretend like this whole nightmare never happened. But I can't. I still have that necklace you gave me. It's hanging in my car, so wherever I go, you are with me. We miss you so much, Brooke. I miss you. Same time next week. It's getting to the point where I'm no fun anymore. I am sorry. Sometimes it hurts. So badly I must cry out loud I am lonely I am yours, you are mine You are what you are You make it hard Don't let the past 
Remind us of what we are not now I am not leaving I am yours, you are mine You are what you are You make it hard Tearing yourself away from me now You are free I am crying This does not mean I don't love you I do That's forever Yes and for always I am yours You are mine You are what you are